you how to make this beautiful daisy or flower rainbow loom tutorial and it's super easy and you can also use it for a ring if you really want to know how to make it a ring tell me in the comments below and i can make a short video on how to transform this beautiful rainbow loom tutorial into a ring the good thing about this beautiful flower is that you can make really different designs for example i made this one with tips of different colors but you can also make petals of different colors in rainbow order and this flower consists of six petals so you can make uh, the rainbow colors in order so let's get into that tutorial so for this tutorial you're just going to need your crochet tool or your looming tool and the bands you'll need for the flower will be three center color bands in my case black and for the petals, you'll need 30 bands. If you want to make different colored petals, then for each petal, you need 5 bands. And then you can alternate the colors to decide what design you want to do. So you're going to get uh, one loom and you're going to twist it two times. So you can have, you can see three little looms. Then you're going to get two bands and you're going to pass that loom through those bands and attach it and attach the other side to the crochet or looming tool like this. Then you're going to get another two bands and do the same thing. These, this makes one petal and you need six so you need to make five more. So now that you finish doing your six petals you're gonna get the one of your centered um, looms and you wanna pass all of your petals through that loom like we've done before to make the petals Now that you finish passing your petals, you're going to get the other part of your center loom. And you want to make a slight knot. So you're going to get the one of the sides that is next to the end of your crochet loom or looming tool. And you're going to pass it over. So, oops, mine fell off, but fortunately I could grab it. So, now you're going to grab that part of your loom and slide it out. And you're going to pull it hard, but not that hard so you break it. But hard enough so the knot is really secure. You're going to fix a little your flower. And now you're going to get your loom and get the three petals that are near to your loom and twisted it two times. Now you're going to get another center loom and you're going to get another three petals and do the same thing and obviously you're going to do the same thing for the the last um, center loom so now you just want to fix your flower and well basically you're finished and if you want you can use that flower for a ring i hope you like this video thumbs up and subscribe